everyone. Um, for those who are still staying long term in Step N, for those who are still uh, believing in this project, um, I, I I was able to come up with this idea based on um, just my own observation of the um, uh, scrolls. So for those who are not aware, aware who, what is a scroll, those are the items that uh, you use if you want to uh, mint shoes. Before, you only need to burn uh, GST or GMT for you to uh, burn shoes. So, uh, sorry, to mint shoes. Uh, minting shoes means you want to produce a new shoes out of um, minting two shoes. So, for example, if I want to mint these uh, shoes, I click mint and then get another one. Let's say this one. And uh, as you can see before, you only need to burn a specific GST and GMT, but now you only need scrolls as well that will match the shoes. So if this is uncommon, I should get one more uncommon scroll. If this is rare, I should get a rare. But since both of them are uh, common, so I just need two common scrolls. So the idea that I came up with is um, by observing the price of scrolls, I know that they've been sliding down since uh, the first uh, day that they were introduced. Uh, on how to get scrolls, they are inside the mystery boxes that you get from uh, walking. So again, there's another video that I have regarding how you get a mystery box. Please check my other video. So that's not part of this video but going back to the pricing of um, scrolls they've been going down since the day it was launched but what i'm trying to think is i try to buy some of them as it goes down hoping um, it will go up in value uh, in the future because i think at the moment no one is uh, using them much because obviously it's more expensive now to mint than to just simply buy um, sneakers from the marketplace but don't forget guys I, I am not sure there's no guarantee that it will come up um, it will go up the prices will go up in the future this is only what I'm trying to think um, I've heard some few discussions before that they might revise something they might do something about the scroll so just like the gems I think it's now good to hoard or hold them. As you can see um, in my uh, list, I have a few. Uh, some of them are I got from the mystery box, but some of them I bought um, as the price go down. So just to tell you what, uh, what are the prices I had uh, yesterday. For Uncommon Soul yesterday, um, I was able to get a 1.25 GMT. The cheapest now for uh, the common the cheapest I was able to get is 2 GMT F I was able to get one rare as, as well at 2.07 GMT so now if we go to the marketplace if you remember the prices they went up a bit I don't know why I'm not expecting it to go up a bit so as you can see now um, uh, where is that going back to the marketplace I bought the cheapest one I bought yesterday is uh, I forgot I forgot but some of them uh, went up a bit all I remember is the fee, uh, rare 2.07 so it went up just a bit so what I'm trying to do is um, uh, I, I try to get one scroll per day uh, it depends on how many GST I got because again if you try to calculate so let's go to the wallet let's say to buy let's say a rare of 2.09 how many gst do i need so you go back to the wallet if you don't have a calculator and you click trade and you select gst uh, sorry you select your us uh yeah gst oh it's the other way around uh just just use another one for now all right so i want to know how many uh Oh, it's the other way around. Sorry, sorry, guys. I mess up. I mess up. So it should be here. Should be, yeah, GST and then GMT. Okay. 
So with the rare, it cost us 2.09. So how many GSD do I need to get one rare, rare scroll? So I need 14.81, right, for a rare. Let's say for a common, which is 2. So I need 14.4. Uh, now for the uh, uncommon, I, ne I need 1.25. So as you can see, uh, if, if you try to convert the amount that you use to purchase these scrolls, they're not as much. GST, I can earn that in one, uh, one day of walking, right? And I can even buy maybe one more rare. So again, guys, uh, I hope you're getting the idea. What we're trying to, uh, what I'm trying to say here is, I try to buy um, scrolls slowly, one by one, and I'm hoping that uh, in the future, I don't know when they will eventually go up. Uh, I heard some discussions that they might uh, revise this. So in short, they, there must, there will be a demand in the future. So as you can see, I'll show you now. I will buy one uh, rare because I have a spare um, uh, GST and GMT, but I think it's not enough. Oh, yeah, it's enough. So let's go to the marketplace, rare, lowest. So I'll get this 2.09, confirm. Okay, so I just bought one for rare. So again, after I walk, as you can see, I will walk... Uh, it just refilled. It's 11.01 here, refill time. So I will walk shortly. So for sure, I usually get around 70 plus for the uh, 45 um, energy session. As you can see, these uh, shoes that I'm leveling up is already 26. So I usually have 70 plus GST, less repair. Usually I have a net of 60, I think. Not, not exactly, but with that profit or with that token that I have, usually I go to the uh, uh, wallet and convert it to GMT and then I will try to buy. Uh, I will try to wait and buy uh, and see if I can buy another scroll, probably uh, common because common is very cheap. Common is very cheap, 1.27. See, I still have 3.03. .03. So, well, how about the common? Common. 2.24. I might just get one more uh, common. The cheapest one. Oh, it's gone. This one. Okay, cool. So later on, I will definitely get one more uncommon after the walk. So that's it, guys. I hope you had an idea, but then again, this is not a financial advice. There's no guarantee it will go up soon. Uh, I think for the long term, it will definitely go up in the future, especially when there's, again, demand for um, minting shoes in uh, either Solana, BSC, Realm. So you can also do the math, guys, in, other, uh, in BSC. Obviously, BSC is a different story. They have a higher scrolls there. But you can do the math. I think as long as you hold it, it will eventually go up in the future. That's it, guys. Let's go and walk.